Have you ever had a bad boss? Someone who made you dread going to work each day? Well, you're not alone. Today, we're going to explore some effective strategies on how to handle a bad boss. Step 1. Identify the problem. Is it a lack of communication, a tendency to micromanage, or perhaps an inability to provide constructive feedback? Understanding the issue is the first step towards addressing it. Step 2. Keep a record. Document instances where your boss's behavior has been problematic. This can provide valuable evidence should you need to discuss the problem with human resources or another superior later on. But remember, always stick to the facts and avoid personal attacks or emotional language. Step 3. Seek advice. Talk to trusted co-workers or mentors about your situation. They may have faced similar challenges and can provide useful insights, but be cautious not to turn this into a gossip session. Focus on finding solutions, not just venting your frustrations. Step 4. Address the issue professionally. If you feel comfortable, consider having a conversation with your boss about your concerns. Choose a neutral setting, use I statements to express your feelings and propose solutions. For instance, if you're feeling micromanaged, you might suggest regular check-ins rather than constant oversight. Step 5. Involve HR or another superior. If direct communication does not work or is not possible, consider involving someone higher up. This is where your documented evidence can come in handy. Again, keep the focus on the issue at hand, not personal grievances. Step 6. Consider your options. If none of the above strategies work, you may need to think about whether this job is worth the stress. Sometimes, the best option may be to start looking for a new job with a healthier work environment. To summarize, handling a bad boss can be a challenging task. It requires identifying the problem, keeping a record of it, seeking advice, addressing the issue professionally, and possibly involving HR or another superior. And remember, your well-being is paramount. If a situation becomes unbearable, it may be time to consider other job options. Remember that you have the right to a respectful and supportive work environment. Don't let a bad boss undermine your self-esteem or professional growth. You are capable, you are valuable, and you deserve to be treated as such. Thank you for joining today. Here's to creating healthier, more positive workplaces for us all.